What did he do? Jesus fucking tried to fuck what the f All right, everybody, welcome back to another video. Thank you all for being here. I really appreciate it. Now, today, I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna be playing a horror game once again called Bloodfield, a story driven psychological horror game with a, it's a Vietnamese made game. This is a free playable demo to the full game, and I'm, I suppose the full game is gonna come out sometime later in 2022. Let's go ahead and relax. Sit back, lay back, lay down, whatever it is you do, and enjoy this video. Or enjoy this as I suffer, as always. Here we go. Now that instrument sounds... Holy shit. Is this... Dude, her talking is kind of freaking scary. Now, what is going on here? Is this an exploration based one? It is a doubtful case of a husband killing his wife and committing suicide. Youth news. A family tragedy happened at dawn. The wife's body was discovered next to a shrine along with a knife as evidence. The husband hanged himself as home at home. The next day, the victim's brother narrated the incident. The cause of this tragedy is still under investigation. Is this based on real story? Is this based on some real event kind of shit? I read something earlier before we even start the game. Dude, this looks like a shithole. You know what? I like the fact that it's not too dark. Most of the horror games that I've been playing lately are just so dark, I don't even see where I'm even going. Look at that! Jesus, the cow is blind! Nice little atmosphere going on, nice music. Decent so far? Who the fuck left this on here? <sighs> Fucking hell, man, what was that? Am I even going the right way? What is this? Is this minced meat? So who am I in this story? That's what I'm wondering right now. Uh, am I the... Am I the brother? That's reported the incident? So, let's not get distracted over here. What the hell? Hey man, stop fucking around guys, I'm just here to find out if this demo is decent. What the hell? Dude. That wasn't even scary. April 17, 1983. Uh, that's a long time ago. I took Tamtai remedy to give birth to a son. <laughs> what? You planned the medicinal plant I gave you in the garden near where you and your wife sleep. 13 days later, that's the kind of shit I have to deal with right now. You need to harvest the leaves, crush the leaves very finely, then boil them, give it to your wife to drink daily for the six for the first six months, guaranteed to give birth to a healthy son. Shaman 2. Drug leaves is missing. Dude, the wife is dead. Shaman too said our child will be a son. He will definitely be a healthy boy. My parent will love this honorable grandchild. After this work is done, I will put in a request to come home and stay with you for a few days. You too love you. Nam. Nam is in Vietnam. I need a key. And another key. And another one. And Jesus Christ. Drug leaves. Dude, fucking scared me. <laughs> Alright, this is where I came from. 
I'm gonna go ahead and crush some leaves for the sake of progression. Ground leaves. Then I'm gonna boil them. Fucking hell, my dude! What the fuck was that? Oh, that's a blue key. I suppose it's for the blue lock because I saw a few locks. Yeah, I'm pretty smart. Everybody knows that. Everybody who's been subscribed knows that. Because they're also smart. What the fuck was that? What is this? Why are you trying to scare me, man? I'm assuming so the the I don't know if this is a re something that I'm going through this experience again that the guy went through, but I feel like the oh Togo hey man what is this? Did you see something? You okay? You okay, little fella? Hey, yeah, I'm a guy. Here we go again. Okay, so as I was saying, I'm assuming that this thing has happened because this fucking idiot gave the drug to his wife, just like the movie. Uh, oh, it's another day. It used to be April, and so we accidentally drugged his wife. I will be home next week. Our son will be born in a few weeks. Remember to use the talisman that Shaman Two gave. Yeah, you do this kind of crap. And this kind of fucking thing comes with some consequences, I guess. It, it is extremely effective. I only burn the amulet, then put it in a cup of water and give it to your wife to drink. Man, this... Why would you do that? Amulets. Burn the amulets. Here. Put some matches that I found earlier. And then what did it say I should do with the burnt stuff? Put it in water again? Is that it? Is it still burning? What did it do? Jesus fucking... What the fuck? Holy shit. Man. Four. It says five next to it, but it's it's four. It's a four, isn't it? Oh, it's four. I, it's, it's four. A five is a V. I don't know. Jesus Christ, man. Four, five, I guess, two, nine? What the fuck was that, dude? If I would have seen something like that, I'd just fucking die. Four, five, two, nine? Yeah? Is that it? Okay, there's more actually. Oh, I got it. This is this is the number one. There was okay, so I got it. So this is okay, the first one is one. There's the third one. Okay. It's one nine six five. No. One nine Six, five. Easy. 
I got it. I thought I would get a key. What the? F what? <laughs> That's it? Oh no, it was so fast! Thank you for playing our demo with the full gameplay coming soon. Well, shit. <laughs> Alrighty. You know what? Stupid game. I did enjoy that. I played so many frustrating indie games lately that that I would say was actually a 6 out of 6 6.5 out of 10. I'm gonna go ahead and leave a link to the game's Steam page down in the description in case you don't know how to find it. Just click on that one. I'm not sure, but I think I've read it on Steam. It says the game is the game in its full is coming out sometime later, 2022. And with that said, thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody. Peace.